Jupiter 1777 says, fair argument, Carter, but should there be limits on CEO executive salaries? Also, thoughts on small businesses suffering slash big tech corp getting richer? Well, I'll answer the, I mean, we've answered the second one before, so that will be an easy one. Uh, should there be limits? Yes, there should be limits on CEO and executive salary, and those limits should be placed by the board of directors who decide how much the CEO and executives are worth. That's how companies work. Companies are voluntary associations between people, and the executive has his salary limited by the board of directors and should. Uh, so in that sense, yes. When you mean, you mean, should the government do it? Absolutely not. Obviously, absolutely not. Um, the government has no right to step in and, and say how much a CEO should, should or shouldn't earn in any case. Um, and actually, I think it's probably one of the most destructive things you can do because upsetting the market in any area, like government regulation in anything, like minimum wage is going to accept the price. You know, you throw a minimum wage law together. It will affect the price of low wage workers and actually will devastate low wage workers. That's it, it can. It can have huge impacts. But it's not going to affect too much the vice president of the company or the, like the higher levels. If you screw around with compensation for CEOs, you'll stop getting the best person for the job. You'll distort the market. Um, and the moment that you distort the market at the CEO level, you entire companies will be driven into the ground. Um, in, like running a company is not easy. I can't imagine. I would never want to run a publicly traded company. I, I would. I would like. There's no way in hell I would want to run a publicly traded company. It's not an easy thing to do. Uh, and if the CEO isn't worth it, um, they'll get fired. Now, do I think CEOs are overcompensated? Yes. I think culturally we value, uh, I think if I were on the board of directors of a publicly traded company, I would argue for more stock compensation and less salary compensation for CEOs. I would, I would like alignment with company success a lot more than you normally see. Um, so I disagree with a lot of the compensation packages, but I would, people need to have the freedom to figure that out themselves. You, as soon as you insert the government there, I mean, man, you think a bunch of stupid bureaucrats in Washington can, should have an input into how much people should be compensated to run major international corporations. You've got to be kidding me. That's one of the dumbest things I can imagine. You want one of the, you want those corporations to get run into the ground, get bureaucrats involved in the boardroom. Good luck. Good luck. Uh, so yeah. <laughs>